All right, what's up guys? Dan over at Going Gear. Bo from Going Gear. I'm the one who uh, does all the videos for Going Gear, but now Daniel's gonna be helping. He's the one who sort of runs the whole shop and everything uh, with the other Daniel who's the shop owner, but. A lot of Daniels. A lot of Daniels. We're gonna switch this whole thing up, and today, what video are we doing? We are going to pick our EDC for under $100. It's kind of a competition. It's gonna be Whoever a can do the best EDC for under $100. I think it's gonna be good. Can't wait to beat you. Yeah, I can't wait to win. It's gonna be great. And also, why don't we give away the best EDC? Whoever you guys vote has the best EDC, we're gonna give it away to one of you. Hey, that's a good value, under $100, just for a like and a subscribe. Yep. Sounds like it's worth it to me. I like it. Let's get started. All right, what you thinking, Daniel? What we got over here? I don't know. So as soon as we decided on under a hundred dollars, my mind just kind of brought me to the to, to the Civivis. Um and that Elementum is looking kind of nice. That gray G10, 50 bucks, D2 steel. I think that's gonna be my saving grace. You mean your saving grace? I think that's what I'm gonna go for. All right, take it up. All right, locked in. Locked Civivi, in. Elementum, gray G10. D2 steel, deep carry pocket clip, on bearings, locked in. Locked in, boom. All right, what you got next? How much is that, by the way? It's 50 bucks. 50 bucks, so you only got 50 left. So I got 50 left. Um, I guess we can fill that 50 with some sort of EDC flashlight or a pocket tool. Ooh, I like that. It's gonna take some thought. Though. All right, let's go find it. Really annoying. You got a lot to choose from right here, geez. I'm gonna go with the Olight i3T. Oh, dang it, that's the one I was gonna go with. <laughs> He's cheating, I was gonna pick that one. <laughs> hey, you let me go first. <laughs> so that's 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 gonna be it. I'm locked in. All right. Olight i3T. And what's that guy priced at? It's gonna be $19.99, so 19 20 bucks. So right. I have 30 more dollars to pick out something else. So potentially like a pen, maybe uh, some outdoor stuff. That would be a good one. Maybe some sort of uh, keychain system. Ooh, some, there you uh, go. Fry bar maybe, or... You should probably like the video because we're gonna start doing more videos like this. And if you like this, comment below as well. Tell us which challenges you want to do, like maybe an outdoor hiking gear set under $200 or something, or $50, or 25. 25 would be pretty hard, but... <laughs> All right, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do Ooh. a Swiss and Tech, right? So you, ha you have to have some sort of multi-tool. Um, and it's gonna be a keychain multi-tool, it's six in one, and that's gonna be retailing for $5.95, so for six bucks, and then for $6.49, so about $6.50, this uh, Exotech free key system. Oh my God, you're making me look bad, bro. That's what I'm gonna do for now. Uh, I have to do the math and figure out what else I can fit in there. I think you're done, yeah. <laughs> All right, we are adding everything up. So I'm about, I'm about at 62. You're only at 62? 62 bucks. Oh my god. I think I got this in the bag. And you have to... Oh, I didn't include the whole light. By the way, if you don't want to go over, you can always stop too. If you think you're set yeah. and you get it for 60, that's just a bargain, you know? All right, so we're not including taxes. I3T, I'm at 80. I think I got... I think I can get... I think I can squeeze a little more or something in. I feel like I'm at a disadvantage here because... <laughs> Daniel works in the store every day. I just come to film videos, so he knows all the prices. I'm gonna be like, Daniel, how much is this? All right, I want this one. <laughs> That's actually pretty true. You know what? I am gonna do, I'm gonna do the canoe wood spoon. Ooh, that's a good for one. For 12 bucks, and then I'm done. You're done? Locked in. Calling it in. All right, let's get him set down. So let me get the prices going here. All right, so what we got here, we got the free key slim system. The Civivi, uh, what is this? Uh, that's the Elementum. Elementum. Gray G10, the Swiss and Tech 6 and one and we got the Canoe Woodspoon, and then the Olight i3T, which I gotta go get. Okay. What's the grand I total? I just tallied everything up, and okay. I stopped at a nice $94.50. You sure you don't wanna hit? You wanna go over that, potentially, or? So do you lose if you go over? Yeah. You lose, yeah. right? You lose, 100%. Right. 100% you lose. It is my turn. This is the shop mascot, by the way. This is Finley. Hey. What you doing? Hey, come here. What are you doing? <laughs> All right, so I'm going to take Finley for with my $100. <laughs> 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 it's 
it's gonna be harder for me because like I said, Daniel works in here every day. I know a lot about EDC, I have a lot of EDC stuff, but- Questionable. Hey, <laughs> do a pocket dump at the end and see who wins it. No. <laughs> All right, so I'm thinking for my knife, I might go Kershaw. They're a little more budget friendly and they're good knives. I mean, I've had my launch, I think it was, yeah, the launch four. I've had that for two years now, I believe. And that thing is amazing. Originally, I want the launch four like I've had, um, but I don't think it would be a good idea because they're what, like $90 instantly? Yeah, as soon as you pick a, a Kershaw launch, you're already in the $90 round. All right, well, this is an honorable mention, all right? Get this knife if you guys haven't. It's yeah. legal everywhere because of the blade size. Just get it, all right? So I'm going to go with the Kershaw Misdirect. First off, Kershaw always has such a great feel. That's what, Daniel, you would say that's a really important part of a knife, right? It's yeah. Fidget factor, 100%. It has a stone wash finish on it. It's nice metallic handles. Yeah, nice good metallic good handles. Thing. Low profile. I'm gonna take this guy. It's about $27. Yep, about $26.95. $26.95. So. All right, so this guy is on the table for me. All right. So you got about $30 right out of the gate. $30 out of the gate. Let's show them the back a little bit, actually. You guys wanna see basically Fort Knox of lights. Exclusive, Exclusive. access. All right, so this is the Fort Knox of flashlights over here. It's also where I'm going to get the flashlight that I choose. I'm going to go with the Aurora series Roby Vaughn. Uh, this is the A5X and uh, it's pretty cool because it's 650 lumens in this tiny little package but also it has all those different modes and the whole thing glows. It has like a UV mode where the whole thing lights up either green or blue, right? Yep. So I'm at, what, so what's my total? So far we got you tallied up at $63.90. $63.90. So not I still bad. got 30 something. Yeah, 20 something to play with. Yeah. Comfortably. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Honorable mention here because I have the knife, I have the light, but I want to look for a pen now because you need a pen in every EDC. We can't do it because I already solidified what I want right now, but we have this pen, which I could have knocked out two birds with one stone. It is the Cobra Tech pen, but also it has a knife in the top. Super cool little gadget. So honorable mention, I should have picked this. You sabotaged me, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> All right. so. This looks extra small in my hands, but this is the Tech Access Accessories Pico Pen. Perfect little EDC pen, got a little magnet, it's real nice and satisfying. Um, obviously this would fit literally anywhere. Good for keychains. Good for keychains, yes. <laughs> <laughs> this guy comes in at $20, $19.95, so I still have almost 20 to play with. Yeah, right? you got around 20 to play with. Around 20 to play with. All right, last but not least, I am going to go with the Hero Clip. If you guys don't know what this is, these are amazing. I have them on all of my bags. Basically, they fold up into a little uh, carabiner clip, but you can also fold them out, clip your bag onto here, and then they hang on to any like counter or anything. So if you're going to the airport, you don't want your bag to touch the floor, you just hang this on the chair. So this holds 50 pounds. Yeah, so that's so. a small one. It's rated at 50 pounds. Uh, it has the camo print on it, and that's going for $17.95. And we're gonna put this guy over here. Another good thing about this hero clip, I use them as well. Um, so that's why I wanted to help them out and give you guys some extra info on this. So the hero clip, if you have a campsite and you have a bag of food or a bag of clothes that you wanna keep elevated, not on the ground to get away from critters or dirt or whatever, uh, you can hang this on your hammock or on a branch or anything like that just to keep it elevated. So this is a really good EDC product, not only for every day, but for the outdoors as well. So would you say I won? Uh, no, I won't go that far. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna tally this all up and let's see how much this is. All right, so read them off to me. All right, so we got the Kershaw okay. Misdirect for $26.95. $26.95. We have the Roby Bond A5 for $36.95. $36.95. The Tech Accessories Pico Pen for a solid $20. $20. And we have the small hero clip at $17.95. $17.95 in the grand total? Oh, oh no! Oh. Oh. Ah, I didn't do well at math in high school or college, so. Yeah, I mean, let's pretend, let's say I gave you a dollar discount. A dollar right? discount? Yeah, let's say I gave you a dollar, or a dollar 85 discount and you made the cut. Th that's right? employee discount, right? Yeah, that's that employee discount. So that, that counts for you. So what let's go ahead and compare both of these because let's say, even if you didn't go over, I 
feel like I still won this. I don't know. Guys, who do you think I like, won? I feel like I won this. So, let's say if you think that Daniel won, obviously just comment what? Daniel? Yeah. Just comment Daniel. And if you think I won with my discount, uh, just comment Bo. But I ultimately, you guys get the winning EDC. True. So I guess it really would behoove you to choose whichever one you think is the best value for you. That's true. And he said behoove, which is a big word, which means... We're smart. We're very smart. <laughs> <laughs> so we hope you guys enjoyed this first sort of beginning of this new series we're gonna do. We're gonna do other videos where we review new knives or old knives and lights, whatever you guys want. If you want anything, put it in the comments down below. And yeah, anything specifically you guys wanna see from us, anything that you guys are curious about, whether it be specific brand of knife, any kind of knife modification, flashlight modification, Cerakote, anodized. I mean, really anything that has to do with knives, flashlights, fire starters, anything outdoors, we're willing to at least give it a try. Yeah, for sure. And and maybe to end each video, should we do a pocket dump? Is it? All right. <laughs> okay, so today I have uh, the Micarta key bar on my keys. Nice. I have the Three Keys Outfitter lip balm. I actually use this, believe it or not, like every day, even if it's That's hot actually outside. a really good one. For my flashlight, Ooh. I got the Surefire Sidekick, which is a must, and piece de resistance. Got the Protec SMG operator Ooh. series with the tritium in the button. All right, so I have the Damascus Steel Ridge Wallet, which is awesome, fit all your cart. Got my keys right here. We got the uh, key fob. Oh, the Tesla key fob. Tesla key fob. That's extra bonus points. <laughs> then we got the air tag, and then on here we have the Orbit key organizer, and that's uh, some genuine Italian leather right there. Mm. You know? And then we have the little fidget. Every Ooh. EDC needs a little fidget, so we got the Lati shuffle in here if any of you guys know what that is their facebook page is freaking awesome they have really cool high quality stuff in there just do this all the time annoy the heck out of my fiance <laughs> um and then a special one right here oh no a little gift from ben uh we got banter my carta version Ooh. only a few of these are made uh they're still sort of in production they are pretty rare i was talking to ben and he sent me this sort of in the testing phase we're seeing different stuff about them amazing quality knife you guys know what banters are they're is that amazing. my carta on there it is my carta it's like forest green my carta it's really nice yeah. it's been sort of my number one carry right now i got the garmin 6x pro right here outdoors watch it's a great watch and that's it so if you guys, we're gonna end this here. If you guys want to tell us what's in your pockets right now, let's see who has the best one in the comments. We'll see you guys in the next video. Stay, what, what did we come up with? Stay bright, stay sharp, stay bright. Stay sharp, stay bright sounds pretty cool. That's pretty yeah. cool, right? Yeah. All right, this is gonna be our new line. Let's we'll do see it. at the end of every video. Yeah.